everybody, my name is Shane Smith, and welcome to the PlayStation 3 Games Holy shit, I have a lot of PlayStation 3 games, and I know, I know that I have a lot. So we're gonna go to every single one of them, and I'm gonna get my thoughts about the game, and that's good or not. So don't forget to like this video, and let's start with this part. Okay, next game, what a sorry. Call of Duty Black Ops 2. One of the best Call of Duty games ever created. Like the first time I bought this, I enjoyed it a lot. And the, like the best looking on the PlayStation 3 Call of Duty game. So fun. Really enjoyed it. Next is uh, Call of Duty Black Ops. It's actually the most liked Call of Duty game, but for me. I kinda hated it because it was too hard actually, there are too hard people like players, really hard to kill actually. Like I rage actually a lot in this game, but it was a good game. Not better than Black Ops 2. Black Ops 2 way better than Black Ops. Next is Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. My sister actually likes this Call of Duty more than the other. She likes Infinite Warfare more. This was actually her favorite at first. And yeah, pretty good game. Cool multiplayer. It was the first flying game. Okay, next, Call of Duty Ghost. The first time I bought it, it was the first Call of Duty game I ever played, and I loved it. But now I hate it because uh, after seeing the other Call of Duty games that are better, and when I compare it to this, this is actually pretty bad. I thought it wasn't good, but is a Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. Now this game, it would have been good if there wasn't hacking mode, but people are hacking this game, so this game is not fun anymore. It used to be fun, but not fun anymore. So sad. Okay. Next game is a Gran Turismo 5. The best looking game on the PlayStation 3, definitely. Like, the best looking game. But if you're gonna play the whole game, you're probably not gonna end this. It's too repetitive, actually. There's no story or anything, you just have to complete the races. So yeah, there's nothing. But good looking game, good cars. Gran Turismo 6, the same as 5, but just way prettier, more cars. Fun game. Next game is Infamous. Now this game is amazing. The Infamous series is an amazing series. I haven't played the second one, I have played the first one and the second son on digital that I got on PlayStation Plus. And yeah, I love both of them. Actually, I like Infamous Second Son more than this one because it has a better story in my opinion. It's good looking, good, more better powers than this. But this was pretty good as well. This for first game on the series, amazing game. Next game is a uh, UFC Undisputed 2010. Haven't played it that much. But the reason why I bought it because I saw my boy Brock Lesnar. Actually, I don't like Brock Lesnar. I hate him. Too. He's lazy as hell, but that's why I bought the game, haven't played it that much, so don't, don't like it. Now the next game, this game is amazing, Hitman Absolution. Now, absolutely amazing game, probably maybe second best Hitman game, somewhere like that. Absolutely love this game, the story of this game is amazing. The combat, the elimination, absolutely about this game is amazing. Couldn't stop playing it, enjoyed it so much. Next game, I I have two copies of this. It's Uncharted 2, so I'll have I'll go to the other Uncharted. But yeah, this game was absolutely amazing. Uncharted 2, one of the best games ever created. Absolutely love Uncharted 2. It was game of the year in 2009. Amazing story, everything was amazing. It was 2009 game of the year, and I played the first part on my channel. You can go watch it to see how it is. Fallout 3. Now, I think this game won game of the year in 2008, but yeah, I played it. It was pretty good, but I haven't played it a lot because I don't have that much infinite time. Yeah, it was a pretty good game. I wish I could play more. Next game is Ratchet and Clank Tools of Destruction. A pretty good game, really fun game. If I, yeah, you could pick it up. Really fun game, I enjoyed it. Next game is God of War Ascension. This game is really underrated. Like, I haven't heard a lot of people talk about this. 
But yeah, pretty fun game. In my opinion, better, but that's kind of more on PlayStation 3, better graphics, story, I haven't played it that much, but I'll play it more. Pretty fun game. I like it. Next game is, uh, the Battle War 3. Now, I wanted to buy this game so better. When I got my hands on, oh, I couldn't stop playing it. I enjoyed it a lot. Still haven't finished it yet, but I really enjoyed it. Amazing game. Next game, FIFA 13, not that. I got that game free when I bought the PlayStation 3. I got this game for free. Which, I don't care, because I'm not the sport type of guy that will. Next game is GTA 5, like I said, amazing game. Haven't finished the story, I only play the multiplayer actually, because the story is a bit too repetitive, it's too long, and there isn't that interesting thing happening in the story, so yeah. And yeah, I have two copies of GTA 5, so yeah, two copies. Like, if one, like, breaks, I have another replacement. Next game is GTA 4. Good game as well. Really enjoyed it. Actually, my sister enjoyed this one more because she was playing the story of this. She hasn't finished this yet, but she played it more than I did. Next game is Killzone 3. I tried to play this with my sister, but it was too glitchy, like it crashed too many times. So I probably play this game on my own to see how it is. Like I heard that it's a really good game, so I hope it is. Now, the next game that I got is Killzone 2. You can see my boy Radix in the front, which is the bad guy. Absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing game. Like, the best Killzone game ever played. The best Killzone out of all. Like, amazing story, like, the amazing graphics for a 2000 pound game. Radix, one of the best villains in the video games of all time. Absolutely love this game. Definitely recommend this is a steelbook that I got only for five bucks. Next game is Battlefield 3. Yeah, this game is amazing. Like it's really fun. Like I played it a lot. I wasn't as good as first, but, but when I got better than them, I was just beating the shit out of people. And yeah, this game was amazing. Then Battlefield 4 was the same like that. That's why I didn't like it for as much as it wasn't. It was the same. Now this game is another amazing game, Uncharted 1. This game came in 2007. I wanted to buy all of the Uncharted games, but my sister said that don't buy one because it's an old game, but I bought it anyway. And I was happy that I bought it. I absolutely enjoyed it. She didn't want me to buy this because it was too old, 2007. But amazing, like definitely recommend it. Like I just said, all the Uncharted games, my favorite games of all time. Amazing game, 10 out of 10, worth the game of the year of that when it came out. There is Uncharted 2 again, like I said, amazing game, game of the year, 10 out of 10, my favorite game. Again, Uncharted 3, game of the year, amazing game, 10 out of 10, my favorite game. Okay, next game is Metal Gear Solid 5 Ground Zero. Now, I was a really bad Metal Gear Solid game. Like, this was the first Metal Gear Solid I, I ever played in my life, actually. And uh, I, I was pretty bad. Like, I failed way too many times. So then, but then I finished it. Like, it took me like an hour or two or three hours, something like that. It took me a lot of hours to finish it. And when I finished it, I thought, a lot of people said you can finish it in 50 minutes, and I was like, how can I finish it in 50 minutes? But then I finished it in 50 minutes, and yeah, but that worked for 30 bucks, I didn't buy this for 30 bucks, I bought this for 50 bucks. Yeah, I have the Phantom Pain, amazing game, Phantom Pain, absolutely amazing. This, this is a pretty good game as well. They hate it because it's too short, it's like a demo, but me personally, I enjoyed it a lot. Next game is Need for Speed most fun. Now this game is pretty fun, good looking game, you can do a lot of stuff, a lot of cards, the multiplayer is really fun in this game, I enjoyed the multiplayer of this game so much, pretty good. Next game we got the WWE 2K14, you got your boy Dwayne Johnson The Rock, 
yeah, the best wrestling game ever created. Like, it is the best movie wrestling game. The roster is amazing. Creating your own star is amazing. Everything about this is amazing. Okay. Next and last pile. I just got this game, actually. And that is Heavenly Sword. Heavenly Sword. Why, I, why do I always say heavenly? It's heavenly. Okay, uh, just about this game, have a, I have played it at the beginning, now I'm gonna play it until the end, see how this like. Right now, a pretty weird start actually, interesting start actually, so yeah. Next game is Dynasty Warrior 8, just about this game as well, and like Dynasty Warriors 2 for me was my childhood when I was a kid, I absolutely loved it. And yeah, I'm playing this one with my sister, like together we're playing the story mode. Like, it's just, even though I know the story of the game, like, I've played a million of times. Like, Dynasty Warrior 7 is my favorite Dynasty Warrior game, and this is Dynasty Warrior 8. But even though I know the story, I know how it ends and that, it just doesn't get boring, it's so fun, you can beat the shit out of it. Amazing game. Loving it. Next game is Beyond Two Souls. Like, this is second best game of, like, not second, it's actually third place best game on my list. Third place, absolutely amazing game, like, third place favorite game. Because second place is Detroit Become you know, the same creator. So this is now third place, and it was second, but then Detroit passed the game, and it was way better than this. Amazing, very, an underrated game, but really worth playing, and I'll... I love this game so much. Played it with my sister to the end. She liked it too. I liked it too. Next game is Skyrim. And yeah, a lot of people love this game. This is actually one of the most sold video games of all time. And yeah, pretty amazing. Pretty good game. I wouldn't say amazing because I haven't played it that much. The graphics, I know a lot of people can play that are isn't that good. Yeah, I know it isn't that good. But a lot of people say that the game gets better if you keep playing it more. So if it gets better, I'll give it a try. Next game is uh, LA Noir. I bought this game only for five bucks because I was like five bucks, why not? And I bought it. I played it a bit at the beginning. Yeah, it was pretty fun. It was better looking than Red Dead Redemption 2. That's the only interesting thing. And yeah, I, actually my sister played this game more than I did. She actually enjoyed this more because she loves uh, detective games. Detective games. So yeah, that's why she played it more than I did this. So yeah, pretty good game actually. Like it started good. If I played it more, maybe I would have liked it more. Next game is Dead Rising 2. Dead Rising 4 is actually my favorite game. A lot of people hate Dead Rising 4, but me personally, I love Dead Rising 4. This game was pretty good. Pretty good as well. Next game is Red Dead Redemption 2. A really light game that Red Dead Redemption 2 came up, just came out this year. Yeah, amazing game. The best cowboy game ever created, actually. Like, you can do so much riding on a horse. The missions are actually really, really fun in this game. Amazing game. Love it. Next game is Borderlands. Now, when I first bought this game, when I was playing it, I actually didn't like it that much because I thought it had a story. I thought it had a story, but no, it was, it was mostly. It was mostly an open world game where you go bounty hunt for people and that stuff. I thought of that story, but they say the Borderlands 2 is better than this, so if I can find Borderlands 2, I will definitely play that one. But yeah, it was fun, but uh, it gets repetitive after playing it. Okay, just bought this game, Sleeping Dog. This game is pretty fun. Like, I was just playing it, I was laughing my ass off. Like, this game is really fun. Now, this game is amazing. The best fighting game ever played, and that is... PlayStation All-Star Battle Royale. This game is amazing. Like, a lot of people say that it's the same like Smash Bros. I mean, I get that, they're right, but the soundtrack, the roster, the map, the they, even the arcade mode of them, it's amazing. Like, everything about this game is amazing. It's the best fighting game ever created. Like, I absolutely enjoy it. The best fighting game ever created. I love this game. Next game is The Evil Within. Uh, underrated game as well. But 
really fun. I actually started playing it a lot when I bought it. I really enjoy it. Really good game. Next game is uh, Escape 3. Really, really fun, funny game. Like, break your bones skating like that stuff. It's really fun. Love it. Next game is the Assassin's Creed Black Flag. The best, the best Assassin's Creed game ever created. Like, you can be a pirate, like boats. A lot of people say the beginning is boring and then it gets better. So yeah, I understand that. I love this game that you can ride boats and all that makes that makes this game so much fun. Really good. Next game is the uh, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Didn't get that much into the story, but I actually love the multiplayer. The multiplayer of this game is really fun. Definitely recommend it for the multiplayer. The story mode, you need to play all the Assassin's Creed games for the end of the story. So yeah, that's why I think. Okay, next game, I just bought this game as well, and that is Batman Arkham Knight. We'll get into the game sooner or later. Still haven't played it yet, because I have a lot of games to play. And last game, and not least, Bioshock. Now, I bought this game, but I haven't played it, because you can see that I, I, I have a lot of unfinished games. So yeah, I'll get into this game, and we'll see. A lot of people say that it's pretty good, so... Might be pretty good. And people, yes, that is all of my PlayStation 3 game collection. How much is this? Actually, these didn't cost that expensive, so that's why I have a lot of these. So yeah, people, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to throw the like button in the face. And as always, people, I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.